Hi everybody, I hope everybody is well and keeping safe. Um, I thought I would do a quick follow on from the first video um, of the sertraline 150 milligram added to my ratizapine 45 milligram and quetiapine 75 milligram. I just thought I'd give a quick update on um, how it's going really. Um, well, I would say. This is, this is day 12 on the 150 milligrams um, sertraline, so it's an extra 50 milligram added to the 100 milligram previous previous months. And I would, I'd, since Thursday, and it's now Saturday, I've certainly been experiencing a few more side effects, um, especially. A few hours after taking three, three, two and a half, three hours after taking uh, my medication, the sertraline that is, I've noticed quite a bit of a like head rush coming on. Um, like I'm as if I'm coming up on it or something, but like a few hours later, um, you know, this even now. Um, I can certainly feel something, but it, I mean it's it, it's it, it's not um, too troublesome though. It certainly it it feels like the medication is now starting to kick in a little bit uh, more than it was at the beginning. I think it's as if I I, I think it's as if. Because I take metizapine and I've been on metizapine, you know, quite a few years, and quetiapine 12, 14 months or so. It's as if the sertraline, which is a more recently added medication, it's as if it's, it's, as if it's kind of trying to establish itself with the other two. Now I've been on sertraline, well, I think it's been my fourth month now, but it's it, it's it's 12 days since you know I was increased from 100 milligram to. 150 milligram like I say the the, the, the medication I, I, I think is pretty decent um, I've said previously in the previous video that it certainly helps with the depression um, and it, it helps to a it certainly helps with the anxiety as well you still have anxiety but it's not it's not too to, it's not as nowhere near as bad as you know before, before I started taking this you know medication. But like I say, I thought I'd make the video because like I say, I've just there has been since Thursday and it's now Saturday. They have you know had a few days of side effects and they they do seem to carry on a little bit into the next day as well. Where I feel a little bit light headed. I've felt a little bit light headed today, uh, but not like I say, nothing too alarming you know I'm not expecting it to get much worse really if it does but this this kind of thing happened when I started the from 50 to 100 milligram on the surgery and I sent to get the side effects a couple of weeks later and that seems to be happening now but he's, I'm not over concerned about it I'm sure it will even itself out um, as as this as the month goes you know I go back to my GP every month to review what's happening um, and I personally think up to now like I said in my first video um, I'm pretty happy with the sertraline up to now even with these side effects it, I just feel as though they may be working you know and once they even out I think I think we'll be good to go um, so I hope anybody who watches this and uh, finds it useful and thank you for the people who've already watched some of my videos. I'm new to this, I'm, I'm a bit of a newbie, I'm going to get some better equipment and lighting um, and hopefully you know produce some better videos but click subscribe, click like, make a comment, good or bad, whatever. You know, they're all, you know I will view them all and hopefully repeat to any you know re reply to any comments but I just thought, thought I'd, I'd do this video just more to it for a bit of encouragement really because taking SSRIs can be can be a nightmare 
Um, but as far as sertraline goes, I, I think it's not. It's a bit more tolerable than of other ones I've tried in the past, like venlafaxine. That was that was that was a nightmare. I think it only lasted two days. Well, I'm into my fourth month with this now, so. But like I say, you do get some side effects, a little bit of head rush, a little bit of tummy ache, but, you know, I seem to be coping. Um, still can get out, um, but I couldn't before Christmas, you know. Uh, I thought it was a trauma going to the, trauma going to the, you know, just the supermarket. But now I can get in, you know, I can get on the bus, travel four or five miles to see my kids, grandchildren, you know, it's not too bad. So anyway... Yeah, up to now, a few side effects have kicked in the last two or three days. A little bit more intense, manageable, able to cope, plenty of water, plenty of fruits, decent nutrition, help your body, and ride through it. Hope to speak to you soon. Hope it's been useful for anybody who's either considering sertraline or on sertraline or on a combination of medication. Um, I will update further as we go along. Um, have a look at the other videos I've made. I've only made three at the minute. This is my third one. So I am a novice to this at the moment. So I hope to get better as I go along. Uh, so hope to speak to you soon. Uh, take care. Sleep well. Keep safe. Bye-bye.